Hello, I'm Alexa. Today I'd like to share with you how diet can have a positive impact on your mental health. I'll also share foods that help improve your mood, boost your immunity, and help you establish a healthy gut microbiome. Let's begin with the brain-gut connection. Our digestion is controlled by the brain, nervous system, and hormones, and in particular, the vagus nerve, which is the longest cranial nerve, creates a bi-directional communication pathway between the brain and the gastrointestinal tract, or the gut. So, the brain can send messages to the gut, and the gut can send messages to the brain. That's why you may experience digestive issues that cause inflammation when you're under stress. Taking that a bit further, current research proposes that imbalances within the human gut microbiome, referred to as dysbiosis, may have an impact on the development of mental health issues and or physical illness. One of the key factors involved is the neurotransmitter serotonin, found in the brain and the gut. Serotonin promotes feelings of happiness, relaxation, well-being, and it also helps regulate digestion. And what's interesting is that the majority of serotonin, an estimated 90%, is contained within the gut. So, getting back to diet and the brain-gut connection, several studies show that carbohydrates increase serotonin in the brain, while high-protein foods lower serotonin. This is due to the amount of amino acids, which are the building blocks of protein, that pass through your gastrointestinal tract into your bloodstream. So in simple terms, it works like this. The brain uses the essential amino acid tryptophan to produce serotonin. Both carbohydrates and high-protein foods contain tryptophan. However, a high-protein meal causes multiple competing amino acids to enter into the bloodstream, including tryptophan, which makes it more difficult for tryptophan to enter the brain. Carbohydrates, on the other hand, decrease and remove much of the competing amino acids, which makes it easier for tryptophan to cross the blood-brain barrier, ultimately increasing serotonin in your brain. In regards to a healthy gut microbiome, you may be surprised to know that humans have more bacterial cells than human cells, and there's a lot of interaction between the bacteria in your gut and your immune system. In fact, a large part of your immune system is contained within your gastrointestinal tract. Within your gut, there are lymphatic tissues that guard against invading microorganisms. So, having a healthy gut microbiome plays a role in your immunity as well as regulating your serotonin. That's why it's so important to consume healthy foods, and specifically high fiber foods. When you consume high fiber foods like fruits, vegetables, legumes, and whole grains, healthful short chain fatty acids like butyrate increase in your gut. These short chain fatty acids are produced when fiber is fermented in your gut. And this process creates more diverse and beneficial bacteria in the human gut microbiome, which leads to greater immunity and improvements in the functions of the intestine. It also promotes weight loss, and beyond that, high fiber foods are high in polyphenols, which have antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties. So, to summarize, a high fiber plant-based diet helps support the brain and the gut microbiome by helping to maintain serotonin levels and by helping to maintain immune homeostasis within the intestines. And when your brain and gut microbiome feel balanced, it has a positive impact on your overall well-being. Let's take a look at some high-fiber plant-based foods that will help support your brain and gut microbiome. You may choose any variety from the list shown, and if possible, choose organic to avoid pesticides.
Thank you for joining me today. If you'd like a free guide to healthy living, click on the link below. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next video.